my dear friends from all over the world it gives me great pleasure to address you as we prepare for the second international day of yoga this unique occasion that brings all of us together to celebrate the invaluable gift of india's ancient tradition when i outline a vision for an international yoga day in september 2014 at the united nations general assembly even i did not anticipate the enormous enthusiasm for the occasion from all corners of the world your support and participation last year and once again now redeems our commitment to nurture and promote this ancient discipline and reaffirms yoga as an exemplary manifestation of vasudhaiv kutumbakam the world as one family i recall the iconic images from that momentous day last year all the way from the pacific islands to port of spain from vladivostok to vancouver and from copenhagen to cape town thousands gathered to unite the bodies and minds through the practice of yoga and the reverberations of discipline found a natural home at the un headquarters in new york where the journey had begun i myself was fortunate to celebrate the event along with 36000 of my fellow citizens and foreign guests in new delhi as so many of you have already discovered yoga is much more than a physical exercise it enables us to access a new dimension of the self even while providing a holistic approach to preventive health care and wellness yoga helps us to restore our balance and furnishes us with a much needed sense of clarity and through its unifying power we seek completeness and at the same time a oneness with the world today all of you are the ambassadors of yoga taking forward india's ancient message to the world i thank you for your commitment and welcome you as sisters and brothers of india's family